let x denotes the number of ways of selecting at least one ball from a bag containing three identical balls three identical red balls and four identical blue balls and five identical green balls and y denotes the number of ways in which the student will fail in an examination when he has write write the examination five different subjects then the value of x plus y is dash here is given x denotes the number of ways of selecting at least one ball from from a bag containing three identical balls and four identical blue balls and five identical green balls that is x is given that is equal to x is equal to three identical red balls that is three plus one and four identical blue balls that is four plus one and five identical green balls five plus one minus one that is equal to four into five into six minus one that is equal to four into five twenty twenty into six one twenty one twenty minus one is equal to one one nine and y is given a student to write the examination he write the examination five different subjects in which it's a student fail in an examination that is five different subjects that is 2 to the power of 5 minus 1 that is equal to 2 power 5 is 32 minus 1 that is equal to 31 therefore x plus y is equal to 119 plus 31 that is equal to 150 this is the answer if sin 2 theta plus sin 2 pi is equal to 1 by 2 and cos 2 theta plus cos 2 pi is equal to 3 by 2 then find the value of cos square of theta minus pi here is given first equation is sin 2 theta plus sin 2 pi is equal to 1 by 2 so squaring on both sides that is sin square 2 theta plus sin square 2 pi plus 2 sin 2 theta sin 2 pi is equal to 1 by 4 and given second equation is cos 2 theta plus cos 2 pi is equal to 3 by 2 and squaring on both sides that is cos square 2 theta plus cos square 2 pi plus 2 cos 2 theta cos 2 pi is equal to 9 by 4. Add these two equations that is sin square 2 theta plus cos square 2 theta. This value is 1 and sin square 2 pi plus cos square 2 pi. That value is 1. Take 2 common that is 2 into sin 2 theta sin 2 pi plus cos 2 theta cos 2 pi is equal to 1 by 4 plus 9 by 4 that is equal to 10 by 4 that is equal to 5 by 2 so here is 1 plus 1 2 that is 2 plus 2 this is cos a cos b plus sin a sin b that is cos of a minus b that is cos of 2 theta minus 2 pi is equal to 5 by 2 so take 2 common 2 into 1 plus cos 2 into theta minus pi is equal to 5 by 2 1 plus cos of 2 into theta minus pi is equal to 5 by 4 we know that the formula 1 plus cos 2 theta that is 2 cos square theta that is 2 cos square theta minus pi is equal to 5 by 4 therefore from this equation cos square of theta minus pi is equal to 5 by 4 into 1 by 2 that is equal to 5 by 8 so cos square theta minus pi value is 5 by 8 is equal to 2 sin beta sin gamma into cosec beta plus gamma then dash here is given tan alpha 
is equal to 2 sin beta into sin gamma into cosec beta plus gamma that is 1 by sin of beta plus gamma so this is in the form of sin of a plus b that is 2 sin beta sin gamma by sin of a plus b is sin beta cos gamma plus cos beta sin gamma so therefore tan alpha is equal to this is 2 by sin beta cos gamma plus cos beta sin gamma by sin beta into sin gamma that is equal to 2 by take partial fractions for this that is sin beta cos gamma by sin beta cos gamma plus cos beta sin gamma by sin beta sin gamma sin beta sin gamma so here is sin beta sin beta cancel and sin gamma sin gamma cancel therefore tan alpha is written as 1 by cot alpha is equal to 2 by cos gamma by sin gamma that is cot gamma plus cos beta by sin beta that is cot beta so take cross multiplication that is cot gamma cot plus cot beta is equal to 2 cot alpha so cot alpha e cot gamma is 1 by tan gamma plus 1 by tan beta is equal to 2 by tan alpha that means tan alpha comma tan beta comma tan gamma r in hp arithmetic progression alpha tan beta tan gamma r in arithmetic progression here is from 2 by tan alpha means that is tan gamma comma tan beta comma tan alpha or in arithmetic progression of real roots of the equation sin power 2020x minus cos power 2020x plus 2019 is equal to 2020 in the interval minus 3 pi by 2 comma 5 pi by 2 here is given relation is sin power 2020x minus cos power 2020x is equal to 2020 minus 2019 that is equal to 1 from this equation 2000 sin power 2020x is equal to 1 plus cos power 2020x if this equation is satisfied for only sin power 2020x is equal to 1 and cos power 2020x is equal to 0 because of sin power 2020x that range is 0 to 1 and cos power 2020x is 1 plus something that is 1 comma 2 so from these relations sin x is equal to pi by 2 cos x is equal to pi by 2 here is given relation is given interval minus 3 pi by 2 pi by 2 that is x is equal to so first relation is minus pi pi by 2 and pi by 2 and 3 pi by 2 these are the solutions of the given if a square minus c square is equal to b into b minus c comma root 2 into a is equal to 2b minus c and capital R is equal to 1 by root 3 then the value of small b value so now we find a small b value here is given a square minus c square is equal to so b into b b square minus bc that is a square is equal to b square plus c square 
minus BC. From this, BC is equal to B square plus C square minus A square. So, dividing by 2BC on both sides, BC by 2BC is equal to B square plus C square minus A square by 2BC. So, 2BC, BC by 2BC, this value is 1 by 2 and b square plus c square minus a square by 2b this is cos a from this angle a is equal to 60 degrees so we know that a by sin a from sin rule a by sin a is equal to 2r here is small a by sin a angle a is 60 that is sin 60 is equal to 2 into capital R value is given that is 1 by root 3, that is 2 by root 3, a by sin 60, that is root 3 by 2 is equal to a by root 3, here is root 3, root 3 cancelled, so, so 2a is equal to 2, a is equal to 1, this is the value of a. Now, given relation and second relation is given, that is root 2, a is equal to 2b minus c, so squaring on both sides that is 2a square is equal to 4b square minus 4bc plus c square so 2a square if we know that a value is 1 that is 2 is equal to 4b common that is b in b minus c plus c square we know that this value b into b minus c from this equation a square minus c square that is 4 into a square minus c square plus c square so your a value is 1 that is equal to 2 into 4 into 1 minus c square plus c square so 2 is equal to 4 minus 4 c square plus c square that is 3 c square is equal to 2 therefore c square is equal to 2 by 3 c is equal to root over 2 by 3 this is the value of c now we find the value of a from this relation root 2 a is equal to 2 b minus c so root 2 into a value 1 that is equal to 2 b minus c that is root over minus c that is root over 2 by 3 from this 2 b is equal to root 2 plus root over 2 by root 3 take root 2 common that is 1 plus 1 by root 3 so 2b is equal to root 2 into root 3 plus 1 by root 3. So from this b is equal to root 2 into root 3 plus 1 by 2 into root 3. Here is 1 root 2 cancelled. Therefore the value of b is equal to root 3 plus 1 by. Here is root 2 into root 3 that is root 6. This is the answer. So the value of B is root 3 plus 1 by root 6. If a triangle ABC is a non-isosceles triangle and angle C is equal to 90, then A square plus B square by A square minus B square into sine of A minus B is equal to dash. Here is given angle C is equal to 90 degrees. That means angle A plus angle B is equal to 90 degrees. So given equation a square plus b square by a square minus b square into sine of a minus b is equal to applying sine rule for sine a for a is equal to 2 r sine a that is 4 r square sine square a plus b square that is 4 r square sine square b by small a square this is 4 r square sine square a minus 4 r square sine square b into sine of a minus b that is 4 r square common and cancelled from this that is sine square a plus sine square b by sine square a minus sin square b into sin of a minus b this is sin square a is written as 1 minus cos square a plus sin square b 
by sin square a minus sin square b that is sin of a plus b into sin of a minus b into sin of a minus b here sin of a minus b sin of a minus b cancel that is equal to 1, mi 1 minus take minus comma that is cos square a minus sin square b by sin of a plus b that is equal to 1 minus cos square a minus sin square b that is cos of a plus b into cos of a minus b by cos of sin of a plus b we know that the value of a plus b is 90 degrees that is 1 minus cos 90 into cos of a minus b by sin 90 here is 1 minus cos 90 that is 1 minus 0 into cos of a minus b by sin 90 value is 1 that is 1 by 1 that is equal to 1 that is the answer any triangle ABC cos square A by 2 plus cos square B by 2 plus cos square C by 2 is equal to dash. So cos square A by 2, we know that the formula 1 plus cos A by 2 plus cos square B by 2, that is 1 plus cos B by 2 plus cos square C by 2, that is 1 plus cos C by 2, that is equal to 1 by 2 common, that is 1 plus 1 plus 1, that is 3 plus cos a plus cos b plus cos c in properties of triangle we know this value cos a plus cos b plus cos c that is equal to 1 plus small r by capital r remember this relation cos a plus cos b plus cos c is equal to 1 plus small r by capital r substituting this value on that equation 1 by 2 into 3 plus cos a plus cos b plus cos c that is 1 plus small r by capital r that is equal to 1 by 2 into 4 plus small r by capital r so multiplying by 1 by 2 that is 4 by 2 is 2 plus small r by 2 capital r this is the answer capital a 1 comma 1 comma 2 and capital b 4 comma 2 comma 1 the capital C 2 comma 3 comma 5 or the vertex of a triangle then a vector representing the median of a triangle passing through A that is here is given triangle ABC is given this is triangle ABC this is A 1 comma 1 comma 2 and B 4 comma 2 comma 1 and C 2 comma 3 comma 5 here is asking vector representing the median through A that is median means passing through the midpoint of opposite side this is the D the coordinates of D is equal to 4 plus 2 by 2 comma 2 plus 3 by 2 comma 1 plus 5 by 2 that is equal to 4 plus 2 6 by 2 that is 3 2 plus 3 that is 5 by 2 1 plus 3 6 6 by 2 that is 3 this is the d bar vector od bar now we find od od bar ad bar equation of ad bar ad bar is equal to od bar minus oa bar that is 3 minus 1 5 by 2 minus 1 3 minus 2 that is equal to 3 minus 1 is 2 pi by 2 minus 1 that is 3 by 2 3 minus 2 1 this is ad bar now the vector equation of the median ad bar r bar is equal to oa bar plus t into ad bar so r bar is equal to oa bar that is i bar plus j bar plus 2k bar plus t into ad bar 2i bar plus 3 by 2 into j plus k bar so take i common that is 1 plus 2t plus j common that is 1 plus 3 by 2 into t plus k common 
2 plus t. This is the vector equation of the median passing through A. Let A bar is equal to I bar minus 2J bar plus 3K bar and B bar is equal to 2I bar plus J bar plus K bar. If C bar is a unit vector such that box A bar, B bar, C bar is maximum, then C bar is equal to dash. Yep, now first we find A bar cross B bar, that is A bar cross B bar, that is I, J, K, 1, minus 2, 3, 2, 1, 1. That is equal to I into minus 2, minus 3. So minus J into 1 minus 6 plus K into 1 plus 4 that is equal to minus 5Y plus 5J plus 5K. Now modulus of A bar cross B bar that is equal to under root of 25 plus 25 plus 25 that is equal to 3 into 25 that is equal to 5 root 3 here is given box a bar b bar c bar is maximum is maximum and c bar is is a unit vector unit vector that means c bar modulus of c bar is equal to 1 Therefore, C bar is equal to A bar cross B bar by modulus of A bar cross B bar. A bar cross B bar that is minus 5Y plus 5J plus 5K by 5 root 3. Take 5 common that is minus I plus J plus K by 5 root 3. Here 5, 5 cancel. And C bar is equal to minus I plus J plus K by root 3. Shortest distance between the skew lines X minus 2 by 1 is equal to Y minus 3 by minus 2 is equal to Z plus 5 by 1 and X minus 1 by minus 1 Y plus 2 by 3 is equal to Z minus 4 by 2. Distance, the shortest distance between the lines is, so, determinant of x2 minus x1, y2 minus y1, z2 minus z1, a1, b1, c1, and a2, b2, c2, by, all by, under root of, so B1, C2 minus B2, C1, that is B1, C2 minus B2, C1 whole square plus A1, C2 minus A2, C1 whole square plus A1, B2 minus A2, B1 whole square. This is the shortest distance between the skew lines. Here is given the point x1, y1, z1 is equal to 2 comma 3 comma minus 5 and the second point x2, y2, z2 is equal to 1 comma minus 2 comma 4 and a1, b1, c1 is equal to 1 comma minus 2 comma 1 and a2, B2, C2 is equal to minus 1 comma 3 comma 2. Substituting these values in this formula, that is shortest distance between the skew lines, that is determinant of x2 minus x1, that is 1 minus 2, minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, minus 5, 4 plus 5, 9, and 1, minus 2, 1, minus 1, 3, 2, whole by under root of this is minus 2 into 2 that is minus 4 minus 3 minus 4 minus 3 whole square 
plus 1 into 2, 2, 2 plus 1, 2 plus 1 whole square, plus 1 into 3, 3 minus 2, that is 3 minus 2 whole square. Now find the determinant of this, that is minus 1 into minus 4 minus 3, plus 5 into 2 plus 1, plus 9 into 3 minus 2, whole by minus 4 minus 3, that is minus 7 whole square, that is 49, 2 plus 1, 3, that is 3 square is 9, 3 minus 2 is 1, 1 square 1. So under root of 49 plus 9 plus 1, that is equal to minus 1 into minus 7, that is 7 plus 5 into 3, 15 plus 9 by root 59. So 7 plus 15, 20. 22 plus 9 31 31 by root 59 this is the shortest distance between the given skew lines the mean deviation from the arithmetic mean of the discrete data 2 comma 7 comma 5 comma 6 comma 4 comma 3 comma 11 comma 17 comma 8 so number of values is given that is n that is equal to 9 and arithmetic mean am is equal to that is 2 plus 7 plus 5 plus 6 plus 4 plus 3 plus 11 plus 17 plus 8 by total number of values that is 9 that is equal to 2 plus 7 9 9 plus 5 14 plus 6 20 20 plus 4 24 plus 3 27 27 plus 11 38 38 plus 17 55 50 plus plus 8 63 that is 63 by 9 that is equal to 7 this is the arithmetic mean and mean deviation m mean deviation is equal to modulus of x bar am x bar minus am arithmetic mean by n that is equal to 2 minus 7 modulus of 2 minus 7 that is modulus of 2 minus 7 plus modulus of 7 minus 7 plus modulus of 5 minus 7 plus modulus of 6 minus 7 plus modulus of 4 minus 7 plus modulus of 3 minus 7 plus modulus of 11 minus 7 plus modulus of 17 minus 7 plus modulus of 8 minus 7 by n n value is 9 modulus of 2 minus 7 the value is 5 modulus of 7 minus 7 0 modulus of 5 minus 7 2 modulus of 6 minus 7 that is 1 4 minus 7 3 3 minus 7, 4, 11 minus 7, that is 4, 17 minus 7, 10, plus 1, by 9. Therefore, mean deviation m is equal to 5 plus 2, 7 plus 1, 8 plus 3, 11, 11 plus 4, 15, 15 plus 4, 19, 19 plus 10, 29 plus 1, 30, 30 by 9. This is 3, 3 times are cancelled, 10 times cancelled, that is equal to 10 by 3. That is equal to mean deviation is equal to 3.33. That is the answer. The variance of the following frequency distribution is, here is class interval is given, that is 0 to 6. This is class interval CI. And frequency F is given. That is class interval 0 to 6, frequency is 10. This is FI. So 6 to 12. That is frequency is 8. And 12 to 18. That is 6. And 18 to 24. That is 4. 24 to 30. That is 2. And now find XI. This is the mid value of class interval 0 plus 6 by 2 that is 3, 6 plus 12, 18 by 2 that is 9, 12 plus 18, 30 by 2 that is 15, 
18 plus 24 by 2 that is 21 and 24 plus 30 54 by 2 that is 27 multiplying these two that is fy into xi so 10 into 3 30 8 into 9 72 6 into 15 that is 94 into 21 that is 84 2 into 27 that is 54 next you find the value of xi square this is the xi 3 square is 9 and 9 square 81 and 15 square 225 21 square that is 441 27 square that is 729 and find the value of fi into xi square this is fi into xi square 10 into 9 90 8 into 81 that is 648 and 6 into 225 that is 1350 4 into 441 that is 1764 and 2 into 729 that is 1458 so here is sigma fi so find this the sum of this sigma fi that is 10 plus 8 18 plus 24 28 30 this is sigma fi is 30 and sigma fi xi this value is 30 72 102 plus 90 192 192 plus 84 plus 54 that is 330 330 this value sigma fi xi now you find the total of fi into xi square so add all these that is 5310 this is the value of fi xi square now variance variance is equal to 1 by n into sigma fi into xi square minus sigma fi into xi by n whole square this is the formula for variance that is 1 by n that is 1 by n is n the value value of n is 1 by 30 into sigma fi xi square that is 5310 minus sigma fi xi Sigma fi xi value is 330 by n is 30 whole square. Here is 3, 3, 0, 0 cancel, 0, 0 cancel. Here is also 0, 0 cancel. This 3, 11 times cancel. And this 3 is also this 3, 5, 1 time 23, 7, 3 is 21, 7, 3 is 21. That is 177 minus 11 square 11 square value is 121 that is equal to 56 this is the variance of the capital a comma capital b comma capital c are the three events of a sample space such that probability of b is equal to 3 by 2 into probability of a and the probability of c is equal to 1 by 2 into probability of b then which of the following is correct here is given the first relation is given probability of b is equal to so 3 by 2 into probability of a from this probability of a is equal to 2 by 3 into probability of b and probability of c is equal to given 1 by 2 into probability of b so now we take probability of b is equal to x now we take probability of b is equal to taken as x so probability of a is equal to 2 by 2 by 3 into probability of b that is x and the probability of c is equal to 1 by 2 into probability of b that is x by 2 probability of c is equal to x by 2 and the probability of a is equal to 2 by 3x here is a comma b comma cr 
mutually exclusive events that is intersection of that values all are zero so that is probability of a intersection b is equal to probability of b intersection c is equal to probability of a intersection c is equal to probability of a intersection b intersection c is equal to zero and the probability of a union b union c is equal to one that means probability of a union b union c is equal to one means that is equal to probability of a plus probability of b <coughs> plus p of c is equal to one probability of a is 2 by 3 into x probability b is x and probability c is 1 by 2 into x that is equal to 1 take LCM that is 6 that is 4x plus 6x plus 3x is equal to 1 6 plus 4 13x is equal to 6 therefore x is equal to 6 by 13 this is the x value x value is 6 by 13 now we find the probability of a that is probability of a is equal to 2 by 3 into probability of b that is 2 by 3 into x that is x value is 6 by 13 that is 3 2 times cancelled that is equal to 4 by 13 and the probability of c is equal to 1 by 2 into x that is 6 by 13 so 2 3 times cancelled that is equal to 3 by 13 and now we find the probability of probability of a intersection c probability of a intersection c is probability of a plus probability of c that is equal to 4 by 13 plus 3 by 13 is equal to 7 by 13 that is first option is correct answer if e1 comma e2 are two independent events and they are random experiment if the probability of e1 is equal to 1 by 2 and the probability of E1 union E2 is equal to 2 by 3. Then match the items list 1 to list 2. Here is given probability of E1 is given. That is probability of E1 is equal to 1 by 2. And the probability of E2 is not given. That is probability of E2 is taken as X. And the probability of E1 and E2 are independent events. That is independent events means probability of E1 intersection E2 is equal to probability of e1 p of e1 into p of e2 that is p of e1 is 1 by 2 into x that is x by 2 here is given prop p of e1 e2 so p of e1 union e2 is equal to 2 by 3 p of e1 union e2 means p of e1 plus p of e2 minus p of e1 intersection e2 is equal to 2 by 3 p of e1 that value is 1 by 2 p of e2 x minus p of e1 intersection e2 that is x by 2 is equal to 2 by 3 so from this equation x minus x by 2 that is x by 2 is equal to 2 by 3 minus 1 by 2 that is equal to 6 lcm so 4 minus that is equal to 1 by 6 therefore x is equal to 1 by 3 that is probability of e to x is 1 by 3 so that is probability of e is 1 by 2 so a is mapped to third relation and the probability of here is b option this is the a, a value probability of e to is 1 by 3 now we find probable p of e1 by e2 so p of e1 by e2 is equal to p of e1 intersection e2 by p of e2 from base theorem p of e1 intersection e2 that is x by 2 x value is 1 by 3 that is 1 by 6 by probability of e2 that is 1 by 3 so 3 2 times cancelled that is equal to 1 by 2 p of e1 by e2 is equal to 1 by 2 so b is mapped to 4 and the third, third one this is b and the third one c c value is probability of e2 bar 
by e1 this is p of e2 bar e2 dash intersection e1 by p of e1 this is p of e2 intersection e1 this is from the set theory that is p of e1 minus p of e1 intersection e2 by p of e1 so find this value this value that is equal to 2 by 3 so c is mapped to 1 and d probability of p of e1 bar my union e2 bar this is the d option p of e1 bar e2 e that is equal to so p of e1 intersection e2 whole bar that is equal to 1 minus p of e1 intersection e2 that is equal to 1 minus p of e1 intersection is x by 2 x value is 1 by 3 that is equal to 1 minus 1 by 6 that is equal to 5 by 5 by 6 if e1 comma e2 are two events of the sample space such that probability of e1 is given that is probability of e1 is equal to 1 by 4 and probability of e1 by e2 that is 1 by 2 and probability of e2 by e1 is equal to 1 by 3 then we find probability of e1 by e2 bar here is given probability of e1 probability of e1 is equal to 1 by 4 and probability of e1 by e2 is equal to 1 by 2 so probability of first we find probability of e1 intersection e2 probability of e1 intersection e2 is equal to probability of e1 into probability of e2 by e1 so probability of e1 is 1 by 4 into 1 by 2 that is equal to 1 by 4 into probability of e2 by e1 is 1 by 3 that is equal to 1 by 2 1 and probability of e2 by e1 and probability of e1 by e2 is equal to probability of e1 intersection e2 by p of e2 probability of e1 e2 by e1 by e2 e1 by e2 value is given 1 by 2 is equal to probability of e1 intersection is 1 by 2 l 1 by 2 l into 1 by probability of e2 that is p of e2 from this equation p of e2 is equal to 1 by 6 now we find probability of e2 bar e2 bar is equal to 1 minus p of e2 that is equal to 1 minus p of e2 is 1 by 6 that is equal to 5 by 6 now we find probability of p of e1 by e2 bar that is equal to this is the formula of probability of e1 minus p of e1 intersection e2 by p of e2 bar p of e1 that is p of e1 is 1 by 4 minus p of e1 intersection e2 that is 1 by 12 by p of e2 bar p of e2 bar that value is 5 by 6 that is take LCM this is 12 so 3 minus 1 by 12 by 5 by 6 that is 3 minus 1 2 by 12 into 6 by 5 2 6 times cancel 6 6 cancel that is equal to 1 by 5 therefore probability of E1 by E2 bar that value is A random experiment is conducted five times if the number of success of the experiment of experiment follows binomial distribution such that a difference of mean and variance of the successes is 5 by 9 then the probability of getting at most two successes that is at most two successes means p of x is less than or equal to 2 that means p of x is equal to 0 less p of x is equal to 1 less p of x is equal to 2 now we find this value <clears throat> given data in the problem is a random experiment is conducted five times 
that is n is given small n that is 5 and the difference difference between the mean and variance in binomial distribution that means np minus npq is equal to 5 by 9 so take np common that is 1 minus q is equal to 5 by 9 so here n value is 5 phi p into 1 minus q value is also phi that is equal to pi by 9 phi phi cancel therefore p square is equal to 1 by 9 p is equal to 1 by 3 and to find q q is equal to 1 minus p that is equal to 1 minus 1 by 3 that is equal to 2 by 3 so n value is 5 and p value is 1 by 3 and q value is 2 by 3 now we find the required probability that is p of x less than or equal to 2 that is equal to p of x is equal to 0 that means phi c 0 so 1 by 3 1 by 3 whole to the power of 0 comma into 2 by 3 whole to the power of 5 plus p of x is equal to 1 that means phi c 1 1 by 3 whole to the power of 1 2 by 3 whole to the power of 4 p of x is equal to that means phi c2 1 by 3 whole square into 2 by 3 whole cube that is phi c0 value is 1 1 by 3 whole power 0 is 1 2 by 3 whole power 5 2 power 5 that is 32 by 3 to the power of 5 that is 243 plus phi c1 value is 5 1 by 3 into 2 by 3 whole power 4 that is 2 power 4 so that is 16 by 81 <laughs> plus 5c2 value is 10 into 1 by 3 whole square that is 1 by 9 2 cube that is 8 by 3 cube 27 that is equal to so 32 by 243 plus 5 into 16 80 80 by 243 plus 10 into 8 80 by 9 into 27 243 so take 243 lcm 243 80 80 160 plus 32 that is 192 192 by 243 cancel this 3 cancel 6 3 is a 6 4 is a that is 64 by 243 8 3 is a 8 1 the, that is equal to 64 by 81 the value of 64 by 81 this is the value of required probability that is p of x less than or equal to 2 for a real variable a greater than 1 consider the points a k a k is equal to k a comma a power k k a comma a power k where k is equal to 1 to up to dash dash n in the Cartesian plane if alpha and beta represents respectively the arithmetic mean of x coordinates and the geometric mean of y coordinates of a k then the locus of the point alpha here is the point a k is given that is a k is equal to k a comma a to the power of k where k is equal to 1 comma 2 comma 3 up to dash dash n and x is given here arithmetic mean of the x coordinates this is given alpha that is alpha is equal to arithmetic means 1 into a plus 2 into a plus 3 into a plus up to dash dash n into a by arithmetic means that is n so take a comma that is equal to a common 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus up to dash dash n whole by n that is equal to a into n into n plus 1 by 2 n here is n n cancelled therefore alpha is equal to a into n plus 1 by 2 from this equation a is equal to 2 alpha by n plus 1 
and geometric mean of y coordinates is given beta that is beta is equal to geometric mean that is a into a power 1 a, a square a cube plus of 2 dash dash a to the power of n whole to the power of 1 by n this is the geometric mean of the y coordinates so here is so a to the power of a to the power of 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus up to dash dash n whole to the power of 1 by n that is equal to a to the power of n into n plus 1 by 2 into 1 by n this n n cancel that is equal to a to the power of n plus 1 by 2 this is beta value beta is equal to a to the power of n plus 1 by 2 from the first equation we know that the a value this is a value 2 alpha by n plus 1 substituting in this from this beta square is equal to a to the power of n plus 1 so beta square is equal to a that is 2 alpha by n plus 1 whole to the power of n plus 1 now find locus of alpha comma beta is equal to is so beta square replacing by y that is y square is equal to alpha replacing by x 2x by n plus 1 whole to the power of n plus 1 y square is equal to 2x by n plus 1 whole to the power of n plus 1 this is the locus of the given p alpha comma beta putting the origin to the point 2 comma 3 then the rotating the coordinate axis through an angle theta in the counterclockwise direction the equation 3x square plus 2xy plus 3y square minus 18x minus 22y plus 50 is equal to 0 is transformed to 4x square plus 2y square minus 1 is equal to 0 then the angle theta is equal to dash that means in this equation xy term is missing in this equation xy term is missing that is xy term is missing means theta is equal to tan inverse of 2h by a minus b 2h by a minus b here is given origin shifted to the point that is h comma k is given h comma k is equal to 2 comma 3 and axis are rotated through an angle theta in counterclockwise direction that is theta is given angle is given theta therefore small x is equal to h plus capital x cos theta minus y sin theta and small y is equal to k plus x sin theta plus y cos theta so substituting these values in this given equation that is 3x square plus 2xy plus 3y square minus 18x minus 22y plus 50 is equal to 0. So it is x value with h value is 2 plus capital X cos theta minus y sin theta and y value is k that is 3 plus capital X sin theta plus y cos theta substituting these values in this equation so that is 3 into x square that is 2 plus x cos theta minus y sin theta whole square plus 2 into 2 plus capital x cos theta minus y sin theta plus 3 plus x sin theta plus y cos theta plus 3 into y square that is 3 plus x sin theta plus y cos theta whole square minus 18 into x minus 22y plus 50 is equal to 0. In this equation we will find out the x square coefficient that is x square coefficient is coefficient of x square is a value is 3 and the coefficient of y square that is b value is 3 substituting these values in this formula that is theta is equal to theta is equal to half tan inverse 
टू हेच बाय ए माइनस बी दैट इज थ्री माइनस थ्री दैट इज हाफ इन टू टेन इन वर्स ऑफ टू हेच बाय थ्री माइनस थ्री दी टू हेच बाय जीरो सो टू हेच बाय जीरो वैल्यू इज इनफिनिटी हाफ इन टू टेन इन वर्स ऑफ इनफिनिटी दैट इज टेन इन वर्स इनफिनिटी वैल्यू इज फाइव बाय टू देर फोर टीटा इज इक्वल टू वन बाय टू इन टू फाइव बाय टू दैट इज फाइव बाय फोर दिस इज द आंसर द वैल्यू ऑफ टीटा इज फाइव बाय फोर equations of the sides the equations of the sides ab ac and bc of a triangle abc are x minus 3y is equal to 0 and 3x minus y is equal to 0 x plus y plus 4 is equal to 0 if p comma q are the points on the line 3x minus y plus k is equal to 0 passing through b such that pb is to B Q is equal to one is two. Then the value of K is dash. Here is given A B A C B C equations are given. Triangle A B C. A B equation is x minus three y is equal to zero. This is first equation. And three x minus y is equal to zero. Second one, x plus y plus four is equal to zero. This is the third equation. So. Here the point line three x minus y plus k passing through the point B. That is solving the equations A B and B C. Solve A B equation comma B C equation. So solve these two equations, we get the value B. That is first equation x is equal to three y, and substituting third equation that is three y plus y. Plus four is equal to zero. That is four y plus four is equal to zero. Y plus one is equal to zero. Y is equal to minus one. So substituting y is equal to minus one. That is x is equal to minus three. So therefore the point B is minus three comma minus one. The given line three x minus y plus k is equal to zero passes through this point B minus three comma minus one. Substituting the point that is three into minus three. Minus up minus one plus k is equal to zero. Minus nine plus one plus k is equal to zero. That is k minus eight is equal to zero. K is equal to eight. The value of k is eight. A one comma one and capital B one comma minus one and capital C minus one comma one. B the vertex of triangle ABC. Let S be the circumcenter. And O be the ortho center, and I be the in center of the triangle ABC. Then find IS plus OS. Here is S is given circumcenter, and O is ortho center, and I be the in center. Then we find the value of I into IS plus O into S. So here is the triangle is given. That is the triangle capital A. That is. This is capital A one comma one, and capital B one comma minus one, and capital C minus one comma one. So first we find R two center. R two center is equal to. So the vertex forms a right angle triangle. That is R two center is repeated x coordinate comma repeated y coordinate. That is repeated x coordinate is one and repeated y coordinate is repeated y coordinate is one one comma one is the ortho center of the triangle and the circumcenter circumcenter is the midpoint of hypotenuse this is the midpoint B C midpoint of hypotenuse that is one minus one by two comma minus one plus one by two. That is zero comma zero. This is the circumcenter, and in center I is equal to. We using this formula A x one plus B x two plus C x three by A plus B plus C comma A y one plus B y two plus C y three by A plus B plus. Here the value A is. Distance of BC that is BC distance is the root of one plus one whole square that is four plus four that is equal to two root two, and B B distance is AC distance that is 
2 and small c value is a b distance that is a b distance is 2 substituting these values in, in center we get in center i is equal to root 2 minus 1 comma root 2 minus 1 now we find i into s plus o s that is i i is root 2 minus 1 comma root 2 minus 1 s circumcenter is 0 0 that is under root of x square plus y square that is root 2 minus 1 whole square plus root 2 minus 1 whole square plus o s the distance from ortho center to circumcenter that is 1 square plus 1 square that is root 2 minus 1 whole square that is equal to so 2 into root 2 minus 1 whole square plus 1 square plus 1 square is root 2 take root 2 common on both that is root 2 into root 2 minus 1 whole square is root 2 minus 1 plus 1 here is 1 1 cancelled that is root 2 into root 2 that is equal to 2 root 2 into root 2 is root 2 whole square that is equal to 2.